the imposing machine hues closely to the design of the Navigator concept that was unveiled at the New York Auto Show one year ago, with its turbine style wheels and intricate chrome grille. The Lincoln emblem in the center of the grille glows as the driver approaches, part of a multi-stage welcome sequence that also illuminates bulbs in the lower fascia, taillights, and puddle lights. More substantively, the new Navigator features adaptive headlights that vary their light pattern based on the vehicle's speed, throwing a wider beam of light at lower speeds and a narrower one at higher speeds. Inside, there's ambient lighting in all three rows. Like the Continental, the Navigator offers front passengers Lincoln's optional new 30-way adjustable perfect position seats with heating, cooling, and massage functions. In the second row there's a choice of a three-person bench or two captain's chairs. The latter offer a tilt-forward capability that allows access into the third row even with an unoccupied child seat in place. The third row seats feature power recline. The rear seat entertainment system provides dual 10.0-inch screens on the front seat backs and can play media streamed wirelessly from paired Android devices. Sling Media subscribers can receive TV channels on the same system. The Navigator also comes with Wi-Fi hotspot connectivity, 6 USB ports, 2 per row, 4 12-volt power sources, a 110-volt AC outlet, and a wireless device charger. The top-tier stereo is a 20-speaker Revel 2 system. For the driver, there's Sync 3 with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility, a 12.0-inch virtual instrument cluster, and an optional head-up display. Available assist features include a 360-degree view camera, backup, stop and go. Phones, Babylon's can